there are some amazing things to see and do in the island of Jersey. Whether you're on a romantic break with a loved one or bringing the kids for a family holiday, there's something for everyone. Here's a roundup of some of the must-do things to include when planning your trip. Our first must-do are the castles. Montorgai is an 800-year-old medieval fortress which stands guard over the quaint little fishing village of Gori. Inside you'll find fascinating artwork and exhibitions, knights and princess dress up, a medieval themed play area and don't miss the stunning view from the very top. Elizabeth Castle is built on a rocky islet just south of the capital, St. Helier. Surrounded by sea, it's defended Jersey for over 400 years. You can walk out to the castle on the causeway at low tide, but when it's high, you can catch the Castle Ferry, an amphibious vehicle which drives on the sand, then floats once it's in water. Catch the Living History characters' midday parade and watch them fire the cannon. Explore the German bunkers added during World War II. Climb to the highest point and check out the view of St. Oban's Bay. And visit St. Helier's Rock Top Hermitage. The next thing you have to do is see the island from the water on a boat trip. Whether that's sailing around the coast, exploring secret beaches and caves, or visiting the other rocks and islets belonging to Jersey. There's also a high likelihood you'll come across dolphins, seals, and other local wildlife while you're out there. Jersey Zoo is world famous for its founder, naturalist and author Gerald Durrell, and the conservation work carried out internationally by the Durrell Wildlife Conservation Trust. There are scheduled keeper talks, play areas, and you can also book exclusive behind the scenes experiences. You can even stay overnight at the park in either a five-star glamping pod or the more budget-friendly hostel. Jersey's famously the sunniest place in the British Isles, so if you're looking for a little R&R, you'll find plenty of space on our world-class beaches. There are way too many beautiful bays to mention here, but after this, make sure you watch our video on the 10 best beaches in Jersey. And while you're at the beach, make sure you enjoy our crystal clear waters by checking out some of the water sports on offer. Why not take a guided kayaking, stand-up paddleboarding, or co-steering tour? After all that activity, you'll have worked up an appetite. As a small island surrounded by sea, Jersey has some of the best seafood available, and it reaches your plate as fresh as can be. Check out some of the locally run seafood restaurants where you'll find oysters, sea bass, crab, scallops and more all caught in Jersey waters. Delicious! The botanical gardens at Samre Manor are a must-see in Jersey. Explore the herb garden, Japanese garden, duck pond and stables. If you have children with you, they'll enjoy the willow labyrinth, jungle path and play area. Then when you've seen all of that, recharge with lunch at the cafe. Jersey is an island with a rich history and the best place to learn about some of that history is the Jersey War Tunnels. It's a German underground hospital dug deep into a hillside which has been transformed into a museum to reveal the true story of life in Jersey during its occupation in World War II. If you're traveling with children then Amazing Adventure Park is the must visit attraction for you. With activities like mini golf, go-karts and a jumping pillow outside, a huge soft play inside, a barnyard of animals to get to know as well as the corn maze, you can spend all day here and never get bored. And finally, while you're here, make sure you catch the sunset in St. Juan. There are plenty of beach cafes with excellent food along the bay, so relax and enjoy uninterrupted sea views as the sun disappears below the horizon. We hope you found this video helpful. Be sure to check out the rest of our videos on this channel and let us know in the comments if there's anything else you'd like to know before booking your Jersey holiday.